Hello, today we embark on an exciting journey back in time to explore the sitcom Sykes. I'm sure many of you have fond memories of this classic show. Sykes is a timeless gem that has left indelible mark on television history. Join us as we relive the magic, revisiting those with the entire cast of then and now. We will explore the names and initial ages of the talented actors on the show and witness their transformation in 2024. So without further ado, let's dive into the world of Sykes. Sam Kidd was born in 1915 in the sitcom he plays Ambulance Man. In 1972, when he was in the sitcom, he was 55, and sadly he passed away on March 26, 1982, at 67. Oh, my dear friend, if only you had the courage to do the same! Who hasn't? <laughs> Eddie, uh, Eddie. No. <laughs> Just take the murk, as long as it's legal. Who is dead legal? And don't get caught taking it. <laughs> John Lyons was born in 1943 in the sitcom he plays Detective Surgeon. In 1973, when he was in the sitcom, he was 30 years old, and now he's 80 years old. Know anything about botany? No. I've got a degree in philosophy, if that's any good. No, no, no. no, no. <laughs> or religious instruction, I've got an O-level on that. Situation comedy is made these days. In fact, for actors, there's very little on TV for actors as such. Well, I wonder whether writers are afraid to write. Eric Sykes was born in 1923 in the sitcom he plays Eric Sykes. In 1972, when he was in the sitcom, he was 49. And sadly, he passed away on July 4th, 2012, at the age of 89. Right for our guests. You see what I mean? The mere mention of a him and its candlelight, soft light, as palagus, and you in your spring in park lane dress. <laughs> Uh, uh, second on because the dancing girls came on then you you, you did your bit and nobody listened to it and then <laughs> Felix Brownes was born in 1922 in the sitcom he plays bus depot worker in 1972 when he was in the sitcom he was 50 years old and sadly he passed away on September 13 2009 at the age of 87 Look, can you tell us uh, which is the way to Sebastopol Terrace? Where are we now? According to the phone box, Sebastopol Terrace. Now, you really must, excuse me, I must get to the office. People, each house, uh, uh, and they'd have three audiences, so be 9,000 people we play to. And uh, I had to go once with him to air. And I thought... Roy Dolchis was born in 1923. In the sitcom, he played Tramp. In 1976, when he was in the sitcom, he was 53, and sadly he passed away on October 16, 2017, at the age of 94. Human caring quality. My dear, the truly evil ones never seem to be so. That's why their effect on other people is so insidious. Someone who could uh, cut hair, and we'd have a barber shop. We, we would find uh, someone who could make shoes, and we'd have a cobbler's. Or people that could make clothes, they would... Ronnie Brody was born in 1918 in the sitcom he plays Postman. In 1973, when he was in the sitcom, he was 55, and sadly he passed away on May 8, 1991, at 72. Next week it's Bambi. The next film will continue after the commercials. That's the manager. I'm on now. John Sims was born in 1930. In the sitcom, she plays Madge Cattlewell. In 1972, when she was in the sitcom, she was 42. And sadly, she passed away on June 27, 2001, at 71. Nothing. Nothing. Not even a broken biscuit. Oh, it's <laughs> all my fault. You haven't let me get a word in, have you? <laughs> I was absolutely petrified. I was really frightened, you know, working with Dirk because I'd only got a very tiny part. But I was so thrilled because the day... Hattie Jackass was born in 1922. In the sitcom, she plays Hattie Sykes. In 1972, when she was in the sitcom, she was 50 years old. And sadly, she passed away on October 6, 1980, at the age of 58. Every night. You were not on Sunday. Where do we used to stand Sunday? Oh, we used to stand in different places. Ah. Rita Webb was born in 1904. In the sitcom, she played Miss Apparat. 
In 1973, when she was in the sitcom, she was 69, and sadly she passed away on August 30th, 1981, at 77. I've got something to tell you. Prince John's up at Nottingham Castle, and he's got a big shake on. The bloody king's back in the cabin. Derek Geiler was born in 1914. In the sitcom, he plays B.C. Corky Turnbull. In 1972, when he was in the sitcom, he was 58, and sadly he passed away on October 7, 1999, at the age of 85. <laughs> better. Lovely day, Constable. <laughs> Rex Lee was born in 1912. In the sitcom, he played a shoplifter. In 1976, when he was in the sitcom, he was 64, and sadly he passed away on March 23rd, 1987, at 74. Now, is this the prisoner that Dr. Waring brought in? Yes, he's got renal comic. I expect you need comic. Richard Wadis was born in 1912. In the sitcom, he plays Charles Brown. In 1972, when he was in the sitcom, he was 60 years old, and sadly he passed away on February 1st, 1975, at 62. At 6 o'clock, you wouldn't have been injured at all, would you? It's all right, you can go in first. Nothing wrong with me. I look after myself. You just... Gordon Rowlings was born in 1926, in the sitcom he plays attendant. In 1972, when he was in the sitcom, he was 46, and sadly he passed away on June 7, 1985, at the age of 59. <laughs> when we reflect on the incredible journey of Sykes from 1972 to 1979, witnessing their growth and transformation, we can see that the connection from those years left a lasting legacy. Their story continues to resonate with fans around the world. And as always, show some love, hit the like button, subscribe for more, and hit the bell to never miss my new content.